A fire in Harrison County this morning destroys a local business. That's right. Alex Hines has more on the incident. He's in the newsroom tonight. Alex? Well, Don Marissa, a business owner in Bridgeport, is figuring out what's next after a fire gutted her building earlier this morning. Artworks owner Lotus McDowell was going about her morning before coming to her Bridgeport business when she first heard it was on fire. By the time she got there, crews were already working to put it out. There were five or six fire trucks already, and the place was just engulfed in smoke. And then the flames started and went out the roof and just took over the place, and the roof started caving in. Despite the efforts of a handful of different area fire departments, it wasn't enough to save her business, which fire officials say was a total loss. Now she's left to pick up the pieces of a place she's operated for decades. It's just hard. You spend your whole life building up for a business and putting your love and heart into it, and then in like one hour, it's gone. The fire also caused significant smoke damage to the Province Market Cafe, located next door in the same building. Officials are still looking for a cause, and Bridgeport Fire Chief Phil Hart says they'll be getting help to determine how it started. Once it is um, extinguished, we'll be doing an investigation and also be contacting the fire marshal's office to assist us with the amount of damage it's done. Despite the major loss, McDowell isn't giving up on artworks. She says she has plans for the future that the fire won't stop. I think we'll assess everything, but I'm not planning to go out of business. I'm not planning to stop. I got too much good stuff to do. So I'll hang in there and figure out our next course and what we'll do to solve it. But we'll be up and running as soon as we can. Still no word on exactly what caused that fire, but we will be following this story and bring you more information as it becomes available. For 12 News, I'm Alex Hines.